Greetings YouTube, we've known for a long time that red caps are more than happy to use direct Nazi propaganda and symbolism in their rallies, in their rhetoric, absolutely right out of the playbook of the Nazi party from Germany during the 1930s and 40s. They are unabashed about this, okay? But Republican politicians usually, usually, are more subtle than that. They'll use dog whistles. They'll be adjacent to the rhetoric of the red caps, but they won't actually come out and say it. They'll kind of rub shoulders with it, but that's as close as they get it. Except, of course, when the lead red cap, the shit given himself, actually reuses the word right in a speech given at a rally. I'm going to go back and make sure that this is, I get this correct. Uh, here we go. So this is what the shit given was blathering about. He says on day one, when he, when, when he gets his second uh, term, he says borders closed, 15 million illegals, aliens deported, economy booms, and industrial strength significantly increased by the creation of a unified Reich. The United States has never had any formal political body called a right. And we went to war with the last person that publicly used that term to get his people motivated and to go to war. In fact, in the 1940s, the United States had a really solid policy when it came to handling fascists. We shot them in the head worked really well for us. It drove them out of power. But now, they're in office. Now, they're running for president for a second term. And actually using the term Reich in a, in a, in a, in a stump speech. I, I don't know how the entire staff of the onion hasn't expired by now. We are we are through the looking glass here, folks. We are so far into La La Land, the closet door to Narnia can't be seen anymore. It is so far away behind us. I wanna crack jokes about it. I wanna make light of this, but it's dumbfounding. A presidential candidate publicly stated that he wants to create a unified right in America. And there are some 70 million Americans who are willing to support this asshole, eagerly waiting to vote for him come November. I... I'm I just disgusted. 